Hi, this is Costa Rodas with Bergen IT. We're a technology company in northern New Jersey that helps both businesses and residential customers. Today we're here to talk about identity theft and what to do if you've been hit by it. Number one, change your passwords. This includes passwords for email, Facebook, other social media, subscription services on the web, absolutely everything. Number two, don't just change the passwords of your credit card accounts and your bank accounts. Close those accounts and open new ones. Make sure the bank and the credit card originators have their strongest protections in place. Let them know that you are a victim of identity theft. Number three, subscribe to an identity theft service. While LifeLock is well known, it's not the best one out there. There are three that we recommend. ID Shield, Identity Force, and Identity Guard. They are all more comprehensive than LifeLock, although they cost a little bit more. Look at each carefully so you get exactly what you need. A couple of them also offer free trials. Do take advantage of that. Number four, your computers need to be thoroughly scanned for malware, anything that could compromise you. To do this, first run CCleaner, which will remove all the junk from your computer, whether it's a Mac or a Windows computer. Then run Malware Bytes which will remove all the malware from your computer, and then run a powerful antivirus product. Don't get a consumer class product, use a business class product that will protect you much better. Number five, if you use an iPhone, you don't need to download any kind of antivirus or anti-malware product since the iPhone is protected internally and does not need to have the, such a product. In fact, if you see such products available, don't use them, they are fraudulent, they don't do anything for you. If you do have an Android phone, yes, you do need to download something that will help you. We recommend Malware Bytes and Webroot for Android. Number six, it's important you use a complex, unique password for each and every account or subscription on the web that you have. It's best to use a passphrase as opposed to a password using at least 12 characters mixed in with numbers and special characters. This passphrases are much easier for you to remember and harder for anyone else to figure out. To simplify this task, use a password manager such as LastPass, which can generate and synchronize passwords for you between your computer and your cell phone. If you have been a victim of identity theft, the steps we have outlined will help you safely recover. These same recommendations can help protect you if you have not yet been a victim of identity theft. Contact Bergen IT for further information and help. Reach us at www.bergenit.net 201-689-1823 or solutions at bergenit.net. Thank you.